Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. Today we're back with a trailer reaction and this is the January seasonal banner and it feels like we've been getting a lot of trailers lately because we had Christmas, then New Year's, then the New Heroes, and now a new banner. Um, and I'm joined by Nagy today. Hello, how's it going? Are you looking forward to anything in particular? Ah, uh, I mean, if it's a Plague Inn banner, there's not really much I can think of or any of my favorites being on it, but I mean... I wouldn't, I wouldn't kill for both Felicia and Flora Oats, but... <laughs> it, we know it's desert, right? Like, from the way that they posted it, but we don't know for yeah, sure if it's Pledging. Yeah, they're talking about something with sand or something like that. Yeah, alright. Well, yeah, I don't. I really don't know who was in the silhouettes, aside from the fact that one of them was pretty obviously a beast, so I say let's just go mm -hmm. watch it. Alright, sounds good. I just really hope there's no Claude! <laughs> oh god. Yeah, because there was three houses last year, actually. Uh, okay, so... Uh, oh, oh. oh! Oh! Nyla? Yeah. I am Nyla. But this just kind of looks like her base art to, to me. Desert. I don't know. She kind of looks... Oh, oh my god! The weapon? Oh. oh god. <laughs> oh, goodness. I just saw Steady Surge. Oh, no. To the wolves. Oh, I thought that was Sturdy Impact. Did I miss something? Yeah, I was steady search. Oh no. Who is that? Is that Carla? Oh, is that Carla? Yeah, I think that's Carla. Holy shit. I may be on a that's really nice way. art, my god. Ooh. Need excuses. Might be Demote, maybe. She's popping. No, Demote's usually the. Oh wait, Demote's usually the that third one, but this is definitely Demote, yeah. Or, or almost. Do Hello? That better not be anyone I care about. Uh, is that oh. Zane? Maybe. Does it even matter who wins? Oh, it. Uh, so oh, Zane is. is in seasonal hell still. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, no, this is the what? demote. Huh? Carla's the fodder five star of the banner. Ah, uh, okay. Oh, do you know? Azura oh. and who's that? Who's the second one? I don't know. You have a beautiful voice. Oh, they're from Papa Radio. <laughs> I, I don't reckon. Is that Leanne? I will help. That's definitely oh, it is Leanne. Leanne. It's oh. Leanne. Oh my god. The art's super pretty. Wait, are they another cavalry range dancer? Yeah, they are. Oh, With gray yeah, waves. They are. Oh, gross. <laughs> <laughs> oh, goodness. Let our voices ring out. Listen to our songs. Do they all get to move extra spaces? I can't tell. I so. You can do it. Oh. <laughs> that was cute. That was really cute, actually. All right. So Every what's the theme, though? The... I don't know. Wait, who's that guy? I don't recognize them. Is that? Is that the? It should be in the in-game notifications. Let me go check. Mm. It kind of... I don't know if... It, I was thinking of um the guy from Shadows of Valentia, but I'm probably completely Great. wrong on that. Uh, you know when you choose between Sonya and that other guy? I completely forgot. I never played SOV, so I don't know. Okay, yeah. Yeah. I always picked Sonya, so I didn't know who the other person was. <laughs> Dean. Is that who you were thinking of? Yeah, that's him. Oh, you were yeah. right. I don't know anything about him, but he looks like he's got a cool design. I like the purple hair. <laughs> yeah, like, he was one of those, like, weird situations where it's like, you can't have these two characters. You have to let one die. It was so weird. Oh. Are they, like, opposite sides or something? Um, it's on Celica's side. Uh, oh. There's, like, a branch, and it's like, you choose either to spare Sonya or Dean. All right, well, let's go through these units one by one and, and take a look. So, Nyla is a red infantry beast. Um, oh, okay, I'll, I'll do the honors of reading this essay. <laughs> oh, so, she's got Canto Rev plus one while transformed, uh, slaying, Spectrum plus five, uh, null follow-up, uh, plus seven damage when special triggers, null guard, there's, there's quite a lot in this weapon, to be honest. Uh, 
<laughs> um, yeah, she's just got, one like... Day, one day, like, the weapon is actually just gonna take up the entire screen, and they're gonna have to scroll down and show the skills. <laughs> oh, goodness. They're getting close to that point, I feel like. Like, they literally... <laughs> I don't know what else they could have fit on this page. <laughs> Uh, she's also got Luna and Sturdy Surge, which is like Surge Sparrow, but with the defense, I guess. Um, I still feel like Surge Sparrow is better, but this is still pretty good. I don't know how the skill works, really, because like I, I don't, I don't have it. I don't have yeah. the Erica. I don't know exactly how it works. All I know is that you can only use it as a melee unit, and basically you heal uh, HP when you tr activate your special and you get extra okay. stats. Yeah. So it's okay. It's definitely like an upgrade over... Well, this is more really like a side grade to sturdy impact, if you think about it. Because impact is attack plus 7 and defense plus 10. Um, but it's got the impact effect. You know, like the... It, it's sturdy impact follow. 5. It's sturdy yeah. impact 5, yeah. <laughs> and then lull speed defense and glare. Um, I mean, I think she's very strong. I don't know what else there is to say. They just threw so many effects on this unit's weapon that... Like, there's very little you can still run in her B-slot. Like, you can run a lull, yeah. or, like, no C disrupt, She's already I guess. got no follow-up. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> already got no follow-up, already got Kanto, which wouldn't even be inheritable for her movement type anyway, because she's an infantry. Oh. The glare's gonna be super annoying if you're, like, trying to enemy face her, actually. Yeah, I think this unit is gonna be a bit of a menace in, um... In summoner duels. Summoner duels. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> That's why I stick to book three and prior. All my know. husbands are in book four and up, so I have to go book four and up. <laughs> oh, no. But it's okay. I mean, yeah, I think she's very strong. I don't know what else there is to say about her. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, are you going to be pulling? Oh, nah, I'm definitely skipping. <laughs> All right, well, Carla, yeah, Carla at first glance looks like a demote, but I guess those skills are too valuable for them to demote, so do uh, you want to like, read the weapon? Yeah, it's, hold on, it's just, you're so used to, like, the five-star focuses having giant weapon, like, yeah. <laughs> descriptions, but looking at this, it just looks like a demote. And she didn't even get an A skill, like, hello? <laughs> it's like, that's so weird. All right, yeah. so accelerate, so slaying effect, it's not a... Turn her on, grants special cooldown minus two to unit. Start of combat, if units within, if units HP is over 25%, grants attack speed six to unit during combat, and deals damage X to unit speed. Okay, I don't know what that means, but... Um, basically, whenever her special triggers, she deals, uh, X equals units max special cooldown count value times 10, plus 20. So, if you're using Draconic Aura, which is what she comes with, I, I believe that's literally 50% of her speed that she's dealing as damage. Oh. And I, is this... This is true damage. Oh. That's kind of massive. It's not even, like, boost damage by... This is full-on true damage. So if she's got, like, 60 speed, that's straight up, like, 30 damage that she hits you with that you cannot avoid. Oh, no. And she just gets it straight away. Yeah, because she's got the slaying, and then she comes with the minus two cooldown... Um, uh, wow. That's quite strong. It's so weird that they give her such an underwhelming kit. <laughs> <laughs> the weapon carries. Yeah, for sure. Because it feels like some people are probably just going to pull this unit for fodder, but I think, like, the weapon is really solid. Like, mm -hmm. I don't think we have any lances that do anything like this, like, preferred lances. Yeah, you're right, actually. I can't think of anyone. Yeah, like, the, I guess the most comparable thing would be, like, under swords, you have, like, Ira and, like, Larce, who do, like, true damage based on speed with their special. Mm -hmm. um, but this is, like, stronger, I think. <laughs> I don't um, know the statistics, but it looks terrifying. <laughs> yeah, I just, the, the one consolation is, I don't know how often you're going to see her. <laughs> that's, yeah. that's the case with most seasonals. Like, they can be really strong, but you're just not going to see them most of the time. Her art's really good as well, actually. Yeah, I adore the art. Like, I think that's my favorite art on the banner. Um... Bartray's lucky. I'm, tell I'm telling <laughs> oh, you absolutely. That. He really pulled <laughs> with her. <laughs> uh, now, Zane is the four star again. Unfortunately for him, I think he was on this, the Halloween banner too. His art's actually pretty good as well. Yeah, it's pretty good. I just don't know why he has been relegated to seasonal hell and four star special hell. Wait, twice? so was he? On the Halloween banner? From what he I was. He was a four-star oh. on the Halloween banner. Oh my god. 
Yeah, poor guy. <laughs> poor Zane fans. Oh. And he's I mean, an infantry healer. Wait, is that panic smoke? In oh, Star? it's it's uh it's fatal smoke. Oh. Well, it's not. It's part. Oh yeah, it's fatal smoke. It's fatal smoke staff. That's disgusting on like a calf line on like your healer oh. calf. <laughs> Savage blur. Imagine that. Yeah, that's actually really gross, because now you can run, like, Savage Blow, um, yep. because you, you can just use Serpentine Staff. Uh, I might have to get that for my <laughs> Silk, actually. <laughs> yeah, this is a really good fodder for a uh, Demote, actually. Wait, is he an infantry, though? I can't- I didn't see. Yeah, he's an infantry, so most people are just straight up just gonna be foddering him off for the Staff. Yeah. Zane. Don't really think there's much more to say about him. I'm yeah, sorry, I mean, fans. <laughs> defense res so but wait, dazzling staff actually. I mean, like I, mean, I, I don't know about you, but I have so much like dazzling staff by this point. I keep getting four star special Maribels when she comes with it. <laughs> oh, okay, well. <laughs> uh, but yeah, no, that's definitely good. I just, I just feel like most people will probably fodder him off with yeah. the staff because it's and by far most the most of the rare. time it's in the weapon as well. Yeah. Uh, all right. Well, the dancing do it do it um so azura is the lead and leanne as the backup and they are a green tome cavalry so this is our second um cavalry ranged dancer which is a big deal <laughs> yeah yeah especially with gray waves oh my god yeah so let's see what she does grants attack plus three if singer dance is used grants attack speed defense res plus six to adjacent allies for one turn Wait, what does that mean? So, like, when Sorry. she dances someone, anyone who's also next to her also gets the attacks? The, I the think so, six? yeah. Oh, that's quite strong. <laughs> and there's a solo in- oh, not a solo, but, like, you know, just attack and speed plus six. Just, just in case you want to run her on offense, you know? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just in case you want to run her as an offensive unit, too, she's also very strong that way. And then Grey Waves, obviously. Uh, if target is an infantry or flying ally, t uh, target can move one extra space. Um, and then she comes with Fury 4, the Far Trace, and Crossbar Res. Which, honestly, Crossbar Res is a bit of a flop, but the rest of this unit is not a flop at all. Oh, yeah. I Actually, I've always wanted, like, a legendary Azura, because I never got a... Same! Or just, like, anything with Grey Waves, or, like, anything like that. Because, like, when I'm playing Summoner Duels, everyone has it, and it's so broken. <laughs> yeah. Just, I just it's, want it's, it so bad. I know, like, I'm, I'm, like, I'm currently debating saving up for her legendary remix, but maybe I'll just, like, straight up pull for this unit. I don't know, I don't really have the orbs for it, but also these banners are sparkable. But no, wait, mm. this is literally bait. This feels like bait. They're like, let's introduce the spark system, then introduce this crazy new unit, um, as bait. <laughs> yeah, you probably got a point. <laughs> yeah. What are they, oh, harmonic? Oh. So they don't score well in arena, right? Just for resonant battles? Mm-hmm. At least you won't see that many of this unit, because you also have to give them the green dual cavalry four if you want to use them yeah, in arena. But th there's always there's also just whales that exist. So, I mean, for whales, this unit doesn't score well. So, like the real whales wouldn't use this unit in arena. Mm. When there's duo dagger who scores two hundred BST, yeah. this unit can yeah, only score right. up to like one eighty five <laughs> with the dual skill. <laughs> oh god. Oh, wow. No, this is definitely just a much better version of Duo Sigurd. Does the same thing as Duo Sigurd in that they're a ranged cavalry dancer, but also just like super power cut version of them. Yep, Duo Sigurd, but they can blow you up as well. Yeah, so. Duo Sigurd found dead in a ditch, rest in peace. <laughs> Let's see the duo skill, uh, what it does. You want to read that? Uh, Ron's Surprise and displays to unit allies from the same titles as unit. Grants enough action to ally with the highest HP that is within two spaces has already acted as from the same titles as unit. Excluding unit. Okay. That's exactly the same as uh, Harmonic Sheeta's effect. But it's a really strong one. Oh wait. For Fates units? Oh my god, wait. Oh no. I might need this. <laughs> oh uh -oh. yeah, for you it would be perfect! <laughs> oh no. <laughs> <laughs> now she's getting don't baited. For, don't fall for the bait. Don't fall for the bait. <laughs> do you have, like, Fae Pass to do the spark? I think it expires soon. I don't know when it expires, but, like... Mm -hmm. 
out of the I think it literally just expires today because like, I just logged into Faye and got my oh, Faye Pass loyalty perks. Oh, probably expires today. Yeah. yeah, it probably expires today. Oh. But yeah, no, this unit is a very, very good pull. She's good for ether raids, defense, and offense, honestly. Um, good. Gonna be really cancerous in summoner duels, of course, our favorite mm -hmm. mode. Because not only can she can she give her great waves, but she can also buff everybody around when she does that. Um, yep. What else? She's Yeah, you're right. Some people are probably still going to use her in Arena, which is going to be so much fun. <laughs> great. Uh, but yeah, no, I don't know. This banner, I want to say it feels like bait, but also this is just an extremely strong unit. The rest of the units sort of feel like bait. Yeah. I mean, it would be nice to have it, but like... I need to save these orbs. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, me too. Like, the orb bank is, is, is fully drained for me right now, so I, I am going to try to not pull. You're going to save for the inevitable Claude seasonal. It is it is inevitable at this point. None of the lords it, have gotten a seasonal, so it's going to happen soon. I just don't know when. Maybe three houses summer again. People are surprised. thinking it might be, like, three houses baby units. Um, like, because the, the, the fact that they haven't done any of the lords yet sort of makes me think that they're trying to save all three of them for the same banner um and like a child banner would be perfect for that mm -hmm. well, knowing Alasha's child units i, I don't want to know <laughs> how much power creep can happen there. they always oh, bring yeah. in the power creep for sure <laughs> yep uh, well i mean so are you are you pulling still undecided <sighs> i'm i'm gonna skip i gotta skip i gotta okay save. good luck with that <laughs> <laughs> It's so hard. Yeah, they really pulled out the top tier bait with this unit. Not only are they two waifus, they've got amazing art, they are an amazing unit, and a very unique movement type. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, I think I'm in the same boat. I just, I maybe I'll get lucky on the free summit. <laughs> that's, that's all yeah, I'm Yeah, for. maybe. Cr fingers crossed. Yeah, you know, Elder V does those graphics like, hey, you have a 3% chance to free summon this unit. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody, let us know in the comments if you're going to be pulling. Honestly, if you are missing Duo Sigurd, this is a really, really strong unit to pull for. Um, and yeah, everybody, please check out Naji's channel. I'm sure you all already know who Naji is because he's very cool and does Fire Emblem content. But if you haven't already, please oh. check out his channel. Thank you for joining me, Naji. It was a lot of fun. No worries. Thank you for having me on. I really appreciate it. Bye, everyone. Goodbye.